An important piece of legislation for millions of Texans, including in the Rio Grande Valley, passed through Congress and is expected to be signed by President Trump tomorrow. Our Marlene Rodriguez explains. It's a legislature that lawmakers have been working on for months that will deliver more than $800 billion over the next 10 years to fund farming and nutrition for millions of people. The Farm Bill, or the Agriculture Nutrition Act, includes funding for SNAP or food stamps, which brought up a lot of debate in Washington, D.C., but is very important for organizations like the Food Bank of the Rio Grande Valley. It's a big uh, budget, but uh, it's a very important budget because it feeds a lot of people. It was passed with widespread support in the U.S. Senate, including from our senators, John Cornyn and Ted Cruz, with 80% of the funding benefiting SNAP recipients. So it's a very bipartisan uh, bill that uh, helps out all Americans, farmers, producers, uh, and um, mostly those people that need the help. So we're very happy about that. The passing of this bill is great news for the organization because the more people receiving SNAP benefits means shorter lines here at the food bank. We simply cannot do that. Nonprofits cannot uh, meet the needs of all the people that uh, need food. The farm bill technically expired in September, but it didn't affect any SNAP recipients or Texas farmers. And now they can rest easy knowing they will be covered for the next 10 years. In Farm, Marlene Rodriguez, Local 23 News. And the farm bill also includes a new provision legalizing hemp.